Okay, Coach Wright, how's it going today? Yeah, I'm doing well, thank you. Excellent. So uh, this is Rafael Marquez here with uh, TX Sportscast. I'm talking to Coach Wright from the uh, Texas State Bobcats. And uh, Coach, how did that game go last week? Well, it's offensively started off pretty well, then we kind of took a little bit of a quarter and a half off and then uh, put 28 straight points on the board. Uh, that, that was that was a positive. Defensively uh, played hard uh, and played with more intensity as the game went on. So uh, it was a, it was a good experience. Uh, uh, as since I've been here since 04, it seems like we've always played down to the, to the Division Two teams, and uh, uh, we started out that way, but the game picked up and, and, and we finished. Uh, I think with uh, very positive things happening for us. Now, I love the quote where you said that it was an ugly win. Um, what, what did you mean by it being an ugly win? You know, it's one of those, you know, we'd like to go out there and, and you'd like to beat everybody a hundred to nothing, you know, but that, that's not always it. Sometimes uh, character, character games happen and, and those games are sometimes ugly, which means you, everything doesn't go exactly the way you want it to. You know, we had a couple of turnovers, you know, they scored on a turnover. Things didn't go exactly the way we wanted to, but the guys pulled it out, uh, pulled, it, uh, pulled it together and got it, got it done. Uh, what would you say would be the key to repeating the victory again this weekend? Well, we're playing uh, a team that's uh, just got got off from beating uh, the University of Montana, the number one team in FCS, and uh, which means they're obviously a very good football team. Uh, they run the triple option, which is something that you don't see. Uh, we used to see it once a year when Nichols uh, ran it. Now they're not going to run it anymore, but so with Cal Poly on the schedule, we're going to see the spread option. It's different than anything else. you got to play assignment football. Uh, you got to tackle the dive. You got to tackle the quarterback. You got to tackle the pitch. So uh, if you don't do that, the, the, they find that weakness and, and they get it to that, you know, whichever one of those three options that they have. But uh, so it, it kind of changes the way we've been playing uh, defensively. And uh, again, a, a good defensive coach and staff like we we've, we've got on uh, with us now is uh, prepared and ready to play the option and getting our guys ready to do it in one week. Uh, offensively, we've uh, they used. To, our offense is going to see a more traditional look from Cal Poly. The last uh, three times we played them, they ran the flex, and uh, which is a defense that Rich Ellerson and, and those guys started out at the University of Arizona back in the Desert Swarm days a few years back. But uh, then he was the head coach at Cal Poly. Now he's moved on to Army. And Coach Walsh and those, his staff are running a 4-3. So basically you're going to see uh, uh, the, all the four three adjustments that you see from most a lot of weeks in our conference and even our team does so uh, it'll be we'll be a lot more familiar with that side of the ball for sure so probably one of the key elements for the game is going to be your defense being able to properly read the plays that their offense is, is trying to yeah we've got to stop the option that's one of those where their whole theory is to keep the ball run the ball run the ball run the ball keep the ball away from you uh, Shorten the game, basically. So uh, yeah, we've got to we've got to do a good good job on defense, get the ball away, and obviously offense take advantage of those situations when we get the ball in uh, via a turnover or whatever the case may be. We, we've got to try to do what they want to do, which is keep the ball, put put, put points on the board. Excellent. Well, thank you very much, Coach. Good luck this weekend. Appreciate it. Thanks.